So today guys I bring you a quick video with the weekly news regarding a new patch which could be absolutely massive for this game. Today we get into all the details we know so far. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe. So info in regards to Outriders is pretty scarce at the moment. With the game being in its best state ever, we as a small community are waiting for those major game changing updates and well, one might just be on its way very soon indeed. So yesterday we got a quick update from PCF, nothing lengthy at all but they do drop details on what could be something amazing for the game. So a lot of the post in regards to known issues with the game in which they are working on fixes for which I'll show on screen in a quick second but the main point of this, the most exciting point of their post comes under the balancing section. They state we are currently looking to buff a few skills for all four classes. Some of these changes will require best spoke code work though as the changes are not just to their numbers but also to the way they function. To that end, we will likely roll these balancing changes into one of our upcoming patches. We're aiming to buff each class in unison and are avoiding split buffing, which is why we need a bit more time to bundle these changes collectively for a patch. Now you can take this how you want people, but to me what I feel this might be is something in regards to an issue many players like myself have had with Endgame for a long time. Basically since the start and that is expeditions are nothing other than DPS build speedruns as basically you need to deal as much damage in a quicker time as possible to earn that loot and for this all classes have certain trees and skills which ain't as efficient as others. For instance my normally build on my trickster although I'm quite capable of getting through tier 15 expeditions solo I ain't doing them in quick times. I ain't always getting gold as compared to what I can create using top tree trickster paired with a shotgun and designated skills to suit it's like night and day between the two builds in terms of damage output. Now I don't think they should bring everything up to equal value in terms of DPS output when it comes to skills but it would be nice to be able to branch out when playing expeditions and not just keep seeing the same old builds due to the need for them in these expeditions. And that's what I think PCF are doing here. I feel they will buff and balance out many skills. But it is also interesting in what they state, that they will change the function of certain skills. This does interest me and it's clear for such it's going to take a certain rework from the ground up. Now exactly what they are doing here we don't yet know, but from the way it sounds this could indeed be the best patch yet. You know the last one which obviously makes the game stable was amazing but this could be something the game needs to move forward so I do look forward to further details on it. Now obviously guys if any news comes out I will have you covered right here on my channel. Now as promised on screen now you're seeing a list of known issues they're working on fixes for. But yes guys like I said a short but sweet video just covering the most important information from this week so far. If you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. Now tell me your thoughts on this and what we've covered today and hopefully I will see you on that next one.